Hey guys, trying to earn your service here, and today we have another Call of Duty Cold War video. And today we are going to be showing you the new AR that just came out, the Farah A3. As you can see, it's right here. So let's just get right into the gameplay, and then I'll show you the class setup at the end. Let's go, go. So this AR just came out, season two. It's like literally might be the best AR in the game. I don't know. It's probably the best AR in the game. So let's get right in. Okay. I mean, look at the time to kill. Look at that guy. He's dead. The gun looks like it sucks because... Look at me die here. Yeah, see, so I have nothing to do. So, before I record, everything's going well. The lobbies aren't sweaty. Nobody's camping with stoners. But then once I press that record button... All of the 24-7 FaZe Clan members join into the lobby and spam their war machines. I'm getting spawn killed. I love getting spawn killed because it's super fun. Like, I, I don't think I've ever gotten out of spawn without a guy camping there. Just, just think about how fun that is for a second. Like, that is so fun. Yes, it's just not... It's not good. But anyway, let's get back to the gun. As you can see, it's just... It's a very accurate gun. It's not the most accurate. It's not like the AK, but... It has... Decent accuracy, decent recoil. Has Goodbye. There's a guy camping. There's always that one guy who lays down at the doorway with a pelling gun. Okay, there you go. Oh, we got him, but we died right after. Period. That's the thing that I like. As you can see, it just shreds people. I mean, we need to get some kills. Alpha. Of choice. As you can see, the range as well. It's absolutely amazing. Okay, that was a close one. Oh, this guy jumping like a frog with his MAC-10. What a... What a cool man. This guy's camping on there. Okay. Rushing is mine. Semtex. Just the fire rate. Actually, the fire rate's okay on this gun, but it's really just the damage, the accuracy. Oh, long shot. We got him, though. There, the camper. The camper. We gotta kill him. Actually, no, I think he died. Here comes the Semtex throwers. Oh, what happened to my accuracy? Wait. I think my hand might have just, uh... Shited its pants because... That might have been the worst accuracy of all time. Okay, why is the frog jumper... Always killing me with the MAC-10? Like, we don't need to be jumping, like... This much. Like, he keeps on jumping. Look at him, he's right here. Look. Yeah, die. MAC-10 tryhard. Here he is again. Here he is again. Nice. When it comes to super close range, of course, that uh, an SMG is a little more effective. But when it comes to just medium range, even then, it's just absolutely a laser. I recommend using a scope on this gun because, just my opinion, the iron sight is not the best. Actually, the iron sight could be good, but for me, I just I can't aim with it. I feel like I'm peeing. Just... Oh, is that, is that... There you go, yes. Definitely definitely one of my favorite ARs in the game. Maybe the most. But there are, the AK is still up there, right? Like, I mean, it's absolutely amazing. This guy... Has good some... Has some uh, good wall banging. Oh, clown guy is dead. Like, come on. Look at it. it I mean, it's just absolutely a shredder. Okay, we got a kid down here. Don't worry. I have to be using some sort of mod. It's... Just look at me. I'm on. I'm in first, and these guys are level thousand. Okay, up there, up there, up there. Nice integer camo. Let's go. I feel like I'm playing like trash in a shoot. Yeah, you're dead. Nice, nice. Oh, could have got a double kill. Come on down, guys. Yep, you're dead. You're dead. Who wants to come in? Oh shoot. 
Yeah. Oh, there you go. We got we got that kill and uh, yeah, there you go. We maxed it out. We got that thermoscope, which I'm never gonna use, but even then, that's good. There you go, guys. I maxed out that Pharah. What is this guy doing? He doesn't know what he's never happened. Dead game. Oh shoot! See that range? Like the accuracy. It's just amazing. Like you're not gonna see that from any. SMG, I really don't think. Anyway, there you go, guys. Let's get right into the class setup. That was a good game. Let's go. Okay, guys. We are here. Finally, we got the class setup. Let's get right in. So, first, optic. This doesn't matter. I'm using the most stop reflex. Anything. You can use anything. You don't even need an optic. But there you go. Next, muzzle. Okay, for the muzzle, I'm using the KGB Eliminator. It's just the best for recoil. I mean, Spetsnaz Compensator, if you don't have the KGB, the Spetsnaz Compensator is good, but the best one for recall, KGB. This is just going to shred. Barrel, okay, we're using the 19.5 Liberator Barrel. As you can see, the bullet velocity is just amazing. Like, this one, these two barrels are uh, alright, alright, but the bullet velocity is just going to make the gun, like, almost just shred even more. It's The bullet velocity is so useful. That's going to be right there. Tiger Team, of course, we're using the Tiger Team helps really spot people it's literally the best for this I mean, under barrel specialized grip best for recoil 20 percent recoil control a horizontal recoil control like just gonna help with the recoil control magazine so if you don't have the 50 round fast mag use the 40 round fast mag always use these fast mags these are the best so for vdv 50 round fast mag and for the handle grew elastic wrap that's obvious the best wrap in the game and for the stock, you can switch between these two, Raider stock, KGB skeletal stock, but it doesn't really matter. I'm using skeletal stock because it has better sprint to fire time. So there you go. There you go, guys. This is the best class setup by far. I'm telling you, oh, sorry, not this. I'm telling you the Liberator barrel is just so good. So there you go. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Shred with the Farah. See you guys in the next adventure. See ya.